Welcome to the VFW. VFW is men that served overseas during wartime, seen action. We do positive work. We take care of the veterans, we sign them up so they can get their free medical. And uh, if a veteran has a problem, we bring them over and give them a good uh, set up with the VA so we can help them. We drive them up there. If we have to East Orange or we take them down to a thing. And this hall here, which we're sitting in now, is anybody who has a wake after a funeral, if a member of the person who lives in the island, we donate the hall free. So if we keep the people in town, they can cook here and have a nice affair. We also, we have a bar that's open to the public. Each member is allowed nine people to come in and drink at our bar. The prices are very good, <laughs> nice and reasonable. And uh, we do the uh, reefs at uh, Memorial Day, at the five sites in town, we put the reefs up. We uh, help sponsor programs for the town. And we're here to help everybody if we can. People come to us with problems, we try to help them. Join the VFW, the first thing is, you pay $25 a year dues. We pay the first year's dues. You get a good magazine once a month. And that gives you a lot of details of what's going on with the veterans, what you're entitled to. Well, I tell the fellas getting out of the service, sign up right away to the VA. Because you may not need it now, but 30 years from now, you want to get your pills, you've got high blood pressure and you want to get your pills and that. You already got all that paperwork done and you still have the paperwork. I have a lot of fellas coming in here now that want to go to the VA. The first thing we have to do is go through the archives in, in uh, St. Louis and get their discharge papers, get their facts of what happened to them, why they're entitled to the medical. When you do it, when you first get out of service, you sign up, you may not use it for 20 or 30 years, but it's on record. And that's what we talk the fellas into. And then when you come in, you're talking to other veterans. You're talking to guys that had the same problems as what you got. The younger fellas coming in, it's no different from, from the fellas from the Second World War, the guys from the Korean War, the Vietnam War. We all talk the same. And the main thing is you're talking to a guy who's been in the same place as you've been.